telling you the truth. She's the love of my life, more than you ever were. She knows everything. She knows what I've done. She don't care. Is that true? Is it? Well, you'll take him on after what he's done. What is wrong with you? What, you... You'll let him in your house, you'll let him in your bed, and you'll take him on even after what he's done? All right, he's done some bad things. Who hasn't? He was pushed and provoked. I mean, he went to prison. He didn't even do anything wrong. He's not a bad man. Really? So it's OK, is it? Everything? Everything Jane told you, that's fine, is it? Jane? Jane didn't tell me anything. Don't lie to me. I know she did. She called you. She told me she did. I saw her last week. I don't know what you're talking about. I know that you know. Jane told me she left messages. She left several. I don't have any messages from Jane or calls. I, I haven't had a call from anyone all day apart from my mum. Not today. Um, a couple of months ago, she called you. She called you to warn you. She told me she did. Well, I lost my phone. I only just got it back. I got loads of messages. I got loads of messages, but I haven't got any from Jane. Oh, I do. Play it. Play it. No, 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 it's enough. All right, that's enough. No, but then tell her. Tell her what you've done. What do you mean, what I've done? Well, I haven't done anything. I haven't done anything she don't know about. Stacey, it's me, Jane. Ignore that call. Forget everything I said. It was a mistake. It was all a mistake. Stacey, you can't tell anyone, OK? Is that it? Yeah, she's drunk. I mean, listen to her. You can hear her, hear her in her voice. There must be more. There must be another one. Yeah, from Martin and my mum, but not Jane. No, there must be. Oh, my man. I mean, that's, that's the voice of a woman totally off her head. He's deleted him. He's deleted him. Talking about that? That's totally ridiculous. Yeah, when I come in here, he had it in his hand, didn't he? Just talking now, about, I saw right, it. I've had enough of this, Dad. What are you talking about? No, don't believe her over me. Look at him. Look, that's Gil. You know him. You know when he's lying. Look at his eyes. Max, are you lying? No. Tell her what you've done. What do you mean, done. tell her? Tell so her. I ain't done anything, have I? tell her. No, get out of here! Oh, get out of here! Get out of here! Are you going to hit me? Hey, what? if you don't tell her, I will. Well, what are you going to do? What? Because ain't true, is it? He killed Stephen. Killed him. Tried to kill Jane. You're talking Dude, about it. I even like an accident, He's a right? murderer. A murderer. He made Jane Thanks, leave. I can't believe a word of what she's saying. What? What are you happy now? Coming in here, what? Trying to wreck another life, bringing your loneliness, all your, your misery in there. What are you trying to do? Wreck everything for me! I'm not lonely, Max. I'm just alone. I thought you were coming back in, Frank. Sorry. I've been thinking. Yes, are we? About Ricky and Janine. Hey, I hey. The kids are fine. I'm their dad. They love me. They'll be okay. It's just us. No, no, listen to me. Listen to me. I'm sorry about this, pal, but you wouldn't leave and let us talk, so I'm afraid you're just going to have to hear this. <clears throat> I had no reason to expect that you hadn't found someone else. Of course, you needed a friend. Someone to talk to, someone to take you out now and again. Like you said, it's been nearly two years. It hasn't crossed my mind, but there you go, that's me, isn't it? It doesn't have to make a difference. I'm, uh, I'm back now. And doesn't matter what he thinks or anybody else thinks, I know you still love me. So tell him to go. Tell him to go now, and me and you can, we, uh, <coughs> we, we, we can talk about this thing. Why don't you just listen to her? You shut your mouth, you pal, or I'll swear I'll shut it for you. Oh, that's your solution. That's my solution. That's it in the pair of you. Then, then tell him to go home. And me and you, we can, um, we can talk about this. He is home. What, what? He's living here with me. We're living together. Frank! 
Frank. Doesn't seem right not seeing me, Dad, on Christmas morning. Patrick's out there cooking your dinner. Don't you think you're being a wee bit ungrateful? Well, we can still have dinner here. Yeah? No, but what you're saying is you'd rather be over there. No. Well, what then? Nothing. Good. Look, no man, I can't keep this going much longer, you know. I say we should start without him. I think worse than soggy sprouts. Where did he go? I'd know off do good in somewhere. But I tell you what, if he ain't back in ten minutes, I'm gonna start dishing up, eh? Hmm. You not seen your lot today then, Mo? Uh no. Well you got ten minutes. Why don't you nip over there now? No, it's alright. Yeah, come on. Why don't you go over? You don't mind? Why should I mind? Oh, well, maybe I will then, you know, just for five minutes. <laughs> I'll see you later. See ya. Hi. Hello, darling. Did you have a nice time? Yeah. Listen, I'm sorry I'm late. It's just that, um, Zoe's back and, uh, you know, I lost track of all time. That's all right, sweetheart. Don't worry about it. You're here now. That's what matters. Come on. Keep your dinner warm. Oh, it's lovely. So you're still done. Listen to it. Every single word. I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, right. Well, let's see if the police do. You know, if they understand what, what I'm talking about, you know. They're coming for you. I've called them. I've called the police. Janine, this wasn't my fault, I swear. It wasn't. I swear. Janine! Janine! Give me that for you. Yeah, Give me that for you. Don't, don't, don't think so. I've got that confession out of her. I'm on your Let's side. Let's just see what the police have to say, no, eh, Dave? Janine! What's the matter? Where are you going? Janine! 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 You can't do this! Janine! Don't, don't, you can't. to say anything, Please. but it may harm your defence if you do not mention, when questioned, something which you let go of Anything you do say may be given in evidence. Do you understand? Oh. 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 
for this moment, me back in the Vic, my wife, my family around my table at Christmas. The Watts family. The Watts family. The Watts. Right, get on with it, Dan. The turkey's getting cold. Shut up for my moment, please. I've still got another little surprise up my sleeve, and it's for Joey and Dennis. Zoe, help yourself to potatoes. Yeah, I will. Go on, then. Favourite chism, eh? Thought we'd all had our presents, Dad. <laughs> I just thought I'd give them something special, seeing mm. as this is their first Christmas together, and it'd be nice to have some happy memories of it. Mm. Welcome to the family properly, Zoe. Oh. Barbados. Oh. Yeah, Dennis <laughs> and Zoe fly out first thing tomorrow morning. It's fantastic, isn't it, Dennis? It's really brilliant. What's the matter? Fortnight in the Caribbean, aren't you please? I would be. Right, come on, everyone, get stuck in. What's going on? Well, I don't think there's anything going on, is there? What do you keep looking at each other for? Look, Chrissy has spent all morning slaving over this hot turkey so that we can all have a nice lunch. So if you've got any arguments with each other, this isn't the right day, OK? It's not an argument, Dad. I really appreciate this, but I'm sorry. Me and Zoe won't be able to go on holiday. What? I won't be here tomorrow. Oh, don't be a... No. We were going to tell you tonight. What do you think you're playing it? Nothing. We're through with playing games. We're deadly serious. We're going away tomorrow. Don't we're say in, it. We're in love. And we have been for a very long time. No, you're not. You're lying. You're sick. You're obsessed with him. Don't love you. Tell her, Dennis. Tell her you don't mean it. Tell her you don't love her. Let go of her hands, Zoe. Let go of him. Oh, Zoe, I'm sorry, but it's true. I do love Sharon. And I want to spend the rest of my life with her. Over my dead body. And how long you had this lined up? Oh, wow. Well, you knew you were planning this this morning when I was telling you what a great team we were going to make. Oh, that's your line to all the girls, is it? What a great team you'd make. I wanted a Vic for us. You think I didn't know about you two? You think I'm that stupid? You knew. I didn't know they were planning this. You told me there was nothing to worry about. You knew your life! No, 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 I was going mad. I knew something was going on. And everyone kept telling me I was wrong. You said, don't be silly, Zoe. You're imagining things, Zoe. I gave Stacey help. She knew exactly what was going on. I didn't believe her. You'll pay for this. Who do you think you are? Why does anyone have to Shut up and stay out of it! I thought I was wrong in the head, being jealous Zoe, every time you was with him. Down, you're getting yourself Why shouldn't I be? Down. How can you love that two-faced bitch me? Zoe. Zoe. Don't you think you've done enough damage? I love your father very much. And heaven help me, I've learned to love you lot as well. But for once, in your selfish, miserable lives, could you not wait until after dinner? <laughs> 